How we are swan and lue in a jazz. How we are swan and lue in a jazz. How we are swan and lue in a jazz. How we are swan and lue in a jazz. Molly fasting in my home. How we are swan and lue in a jazz. Hallelujah. <laughs> We denounce anything, Lord, that is in us, but not of yours. We denounce everything, Lord, 
that is contrary to your spirit, Mapilong Arona. Ribua Jolo Kata Fita Mudimuaka, Boka Joho Famoyawaka, let's all let the caron. I get a Rory Celibito La Mudimo. Rerenka Lensula Hau Mudimo, Elebolo Capilon Sarona, or the Segera Citello Mudimuaka Lukile. Rao Bok and Tatarao Halalets and Mudimuaka Lets and Halalel. A Shokamoyawa Hau or Halalela. Or a bear one now, it's a mosevitz in my pillow, a roll and dirty. Calibit, so large is so crest them rain. Thank you, Lord. Shall we sit in the presence of the Lord? Greetings to all beloved Calibit, so little like crest them rain. Kidu made his abode, Calibit, so I'm going to move police. I'm initiating a brother Mudisa today. <laughs> the Lord is good. You know, every time when you, you say that, I wish that you do that with sincere heart and understanding. You know, once you say you are a Christian, you have started a war. And now this war, it's not that much physical. But it is more spiritual. And it will destroy you if you are playing. It will destroy you. I just sense to bring that warning. I don't know why. But if you play with this, how it will destroy you. Seek the Lord and all his righteousness. Bata mudimu lehuluka vahai. Only, that's what you need to do. Kiyo yona fela ushoka nguyet. And that says, walk in obedience of the Holy Spirit. Seo sibulela uruhotsa maya, kahu mamela butimba mudimu. Not walking in obedience of a pastor or the church. But walking in the obedience of the Holy Spirit. And therefore your ways will be successful. Your ways, you know. Not certain thing, but your ways will be successful. I wish you could understand the jealous that I have. For if you say you are a Christian. And you say you are a partner in this church. It's my, it's, I've got this jealous that I want you to f- reach full potential of what God wants to do. But because there's a craving in my spirit, can't we? That we, we uh, there's no enough hunger. Hauna sala ele cane. Or the desire, enough desire. Oh, toko ele cane. Look here, desire, it's not for a tamile or go born or you are in desire, you want this. No, 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 no. Toko has your retanet or rebero born or utoko nyan. But it is the attitude of the heart when it comes to God. You need to have a heart that really anger for God. And that heart needs to make you when the service ends. 
You must be able to forget who was sitting where, which color. You must just scrap on what God was busy with you. May the spirit of religion die. How I desire that we can be hunger more just to walk with the Lord. Our youth today went out to an outreach. We have a project that we started. We said invading the city. There will be a Sunday you will come like this in church. It's not a planned Sunday. It will just happen spontaneous. When you come in, how can I? If you are used to come 30 minutes after the service is started, that particular Sunday, I'm not going to get anyone in church. I can assure you. Because we will be invading the city. Yes. At a true activity. For the field is huge. But laborers are few. So our youth is, is out. And the second thing just I want to emphasize on the wedding. Is that you are requested. Or first you are all invited. But seats are limited. So you are expected if you, you know that you want to be at the wedding at the 10th of December. Um, I think there will be a register at the back there. Just put your name if you know somebody sure that it's not here and you are sure that that person will be here. Just put your name again. So that people will know that you are there. So it's only 80 seats that are available. And if you are 81, then it means you are not on the list. Are we okay about that? Okay, we thank the Lord with the night prayer that we come from. And we thank God that that is always faithful. And the way that I crept in that night prayer, I, I will always cherish those words. That it is not me talking to you. But it's God talking to you through me. <laughs> so I But Okay. Now, how many of you have been exposed to be more? or in the river. Uh, and, and, you, and see the waves, how waves of the sea flow. Or how the water, 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 how the
I always tell people that I, I don't know how to swim. But I can tell you that I'm the best swimmer <laughs> at the sea. Because I use the waves to swim. So I'll wait for the waves to push me. Then again, eh. and after that, I'm so satisfied to swim. But if you can put me in the pool, I'm going to But if you can put me in the pool, I'm going to sink. So I want you to have that picture here. That a lady, when he's in the waves, oh, he can... But uh, in the dam or swimming pool, uh, now, the, the, the waves of the sea sometimes are able to put the boat into a, a, a situation where it might sink. And everyone who is in the ship is in the danger of dying, actually. And now when, I don't know how, have you seen um, the movie that I watched and enjoyed it, the whole thing, Kayona? Uh, uh, it's Titanic. During emergency in a ship, when water comes in or there's a hole and there's this thing, danger that it will, might sink. There's only one person where people are looking at. And that is the captain of the ship. Now, imagine the captain of the ship being standing and saying, everybody for himself. I can assure you there will be chaos. Then everybody will be jumping on each other. Grapping what do you think is important for you? And think about the escape. Now, now listen that. Thinking escape, not rescue. Hey, did, did you get that? Eh? You think escape, not risk. And the law of the marine is when there is danger, rescue come first. But then if it's the captain that says, everybody for himself, then we are all in danger. But if the captain of the ship, if he can say all hands on the deck, hey, 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 hey. It's a, you're going to see how people understand themselves. You know, you start to understand why they trained you so hard. Why they trained them. Because uh, um, I was a soldier and know how, what I'm talking about. There will be exercises that they say you do and you look at this and say this is very foolish. I was in prison again. And I'll be taught how to handle a prisoner and I'll say this is very stupid. But you realize in a moment of danger, hey, in the moment of emergency, what did they taught you? Here I go two years ago. It is beneficial right now. The same thing with everyone finds himself in a ship. When the captain says, all hands on the deck, Julia, you are not going to say, 
But my shift ended two hours ago. It's my time to rest. You put whatever you have to put quickly. Then you run to a certain place that is called the assembly point. And when you go there, you wait for the next command. What to do now? So everybody takes his position. Because now it is a bad time. Now we don't take positions only during bad times only. And we have that default in us, trying to do good when it's bad. But when it's good, we just want to relax. And our minds begin to do what I said on Friday night. We begin to have idling mind in us. And when your mind begins to idle, actually, it's not just stagnant. That door gets opened. Because now you are on an idle mode. So now, there are two things that happens here. The commander gives an instruction and people respond. And now it will be a matter of what the captain has said. But the one who says all hands on the deck everybody takes his position and do the work. There's no that this is not my shift, it is that person's shift. All of us, we run together. For all our hands are on the deck. So there are two calls. But the outcome is not the same. So those who said that everybody for himself, I can assure you people will be so injured at the end of the day. But when we say all hands on the deck, we are safe in that space. I want us to read in the book of Luke 10, verse 30. Luke 10, verse 30. Luke 10, we read from verse 30. It's a popular story that we know in the Bible. But I want you to Realize something important in terms of our series. Luke 10, verse 30. Jesus answered, A certain man was going down from Jerusalem to Jericho. And he fell among robbers who both stripped him. Who both stripped him and beat him. And departed. And leaving him half dead. By just touching on these points only. There's so much that we can talk about right now. But we are not about to talk about all those being, stripped, being left half dead. Let's continue. By chance, a certain priest was going down that way. Yeah. When he saw him, he passed by on the other side. In the same way, a Levite also, when he came to the place, he and saw him passed on on the other side. But a certain Samaritan, as he traveled, came where he was. 
When he saw him, he was moved with compassion and bound up his wounds, pouring on oil and wine. He set him on his own, he, on his own animal and brought him to an inn and took in, care of him. On the next day, when he departed, he took out two dinars, gave them to the host and gave it to the owner of the house. And said to him, Take care of him. Whatever you spend beyond that, I will repay you when I return. Now, which of these three do you think seem to be a neighbor? to him who fell among the robbers. Kimang ka araba babarar o tlareng ke yena mohaisane ya moleki. Then he said, ya ba uri, he who showed mercy on him. Ya bontsitse mohau hon. Then then Jesus said to him, ya ba nene morena Jesu uri ho yena. Go and do likewise. You know, I picture in my mind. And I, I gave myself this picture. It's like Christ was busy with something, you know, not necessarily the, 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 the preaching, the ministry. Now, remember, he's a carpenter by skill, this guy. So it could be Christ in Nakong was busy with wood, you know. And he get this question about it being who's my right neighbor. So you imagine now when this ends here, when he says go and do likewise, then he continued doing what he was doing. So now. I give you a picture here, the emergency or the disaster in the sea. And now I brought the parable that Christ said about the neighbor. So, even you go today and check um, how is uh, um, the route that leads to Jerusalem. Uh, if you have to go to Jerusalem, you have to pass Jericho. How no Chanela who Jerusalem or not Amel fit a Jericho pig. And now it's such a, 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 a dangerous route. To <inaudible> take to reach Jerusalem. So as I said, I don't want to talk about the uh, what happened about that guy? But what I want you to take out of it, the fact that a, a priest passed that guy, a Levite, but a Samaritan paid attention and showed act of love. And that love was not just for the right. But he used his hands to make sure this guy is right. bandage begin to roll and that man will be fine. But he used his hands to attend to him. But in the times that we are living in, in the times of everyone for himself, and God for us all, 
We, we have this culture of everyone to himself. And we do it so nice, we are not even offending anyone when we do it. You can't even see that we are not Because we give you hugs. And we smile with you. But deep down, I might have a bigger dagger than a, a, a Rambo on the on Rambo movies. Yes, could be bigger than that. And now that culture of every man for himself. When we are supposed to figure out on our own we have this fear in us that I will be doing this or I'll be saying this and people will start gossip about me. Or oh, if I say this thing eh, that is more of showing weakness about Kappa, me, it will be giving away a weapon that people can use against me. And this happened in Rwanda, Bazalwan. It happened in Rwanda. So it's Rwanda. If you, you, you have followed the history, why so many people were killed in Rwanda? How can the history say that all the killings that took place were not done by people that were not known? By measurement of your nose, then that sentence can be passed. You are not a cause you're a suit, then you die. Who toots and toots? That's what happened in Rwanda. And now look at this picture. People who were killing each other or who were killing others more are people who were always in church on Sunday. Rwanda is one of the largest uh, religious countries that you can be at. Rwanda But in this very same, same space, we had genocide. Christians killed other Christians in Rwanda. And all of these people call themselves Christians. When your hand is misplaced, when your hand is misplaced, if you don't find what to do with your hand, you will do the wrong things. So these people, their hands were on deck. It's a fact. But they were at work, killing each other. Now there's a there's a Shona proverb. The Zim guys will, will like this one. I, I, um, okay, I'm going to start. <laughs> on, 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 on Friday, when you you do you did the, the Shona line, I laughed and said, <laughs> Because I have this slide mm -hmm. and I struggle with it on Thursday. I try <laughs> to practice it. Because What you have found? Sells it toti. Mutoro ane hangwan. Sells it toting. Si je leba 
le la pala hao ka pole ba heno okay hallelujah everybody for himself ne ye mon le ye mon se ba ke nsa ha we are not working together ha re sebetse mmo because we have chawawa go bane re na le yona nthwele a ore ye mon le ye mon se o se a se thotseng a se jele ba ntlo ya ha so this proverb says that uh, make sure that when you have bread share it with those who are around you bare we etse bon or your relatives for that matter because those who are strangers won't be around to assist you next time you know the, the, this this guy who was left half dead I can assure you in his heart and in his mind. He had this hope. I know this road is dangerous. But now remember he's saying these things lying down. Then, then the hope that he had was that no maranja, a Jew will become me. But it came a Jew. Yaba hotla mojuta. And Pasimba. Yaba we pitela fe. Came another one. Yaba hotla yemu. Kadi offices abo na ve. Hola tela maemo abo. Because maybe when he heard or he saw that oh now is a Levite, I know him now my redeemer has saved me. Oh yeah, obani kana kongo na kana na na. But he passed by the way. Kau hotla muli fi kito buluke. But came a stranger. You saved him. And therefore, somehow, thinking that giving food to your brothers and your, your friends, you are safe, it's not enough. But you just need to be generous. Generosity means simple thing making yourself available to say after any action that you do whoever is the recipient of whatever you are doing can say to you thank you kalebo it's fine but out of that act impaning kan tle ho tseo motho o tlamela bona matla modi that person must see the righteousness of god a ke re re matswa rona a mo sebetse re batla go sebetse so motho o tlamela a bona matla le boholo ba modimo from your action or attitude of being generous ho tswa diketsong ka pa boitshorong ba hao ba ho bula pelo ya hao there are many forms of giving ho na le dintho tse ngata tsa ofana but this one of level of being generous impa e na na nya hore o be level nya hore o butse pelo ya hao it is the main idea is to somebody to say i saw god here And in my experiences, Nana Lady, I've never been in a night prayer. Believe me, I've never been in a night prayer. The Saturday or the Sunday, big sabone encounter a miraculous thing. I say it's a halun tone. It's a halun every time. It's a halun every time that is the night prayer. I experienced it yesterday again. Hallelujah. So cho ran ka ba night prayer every Monday till Friday. Hey, get lo kopa na le ntho tse di. So I either experience something good or something bad. Because what is happening when I come out in that kind of prayer? Kamara o tsa thapelong. God exposes everything in me be a pepene ne. O bona di ntho tsohle ka bona ta pepene ne. E ka ba tse ntle ka potse mpe. And it happened yesterday I'm moving I'm, I'm in the shop and I'm looking around what is it that I want here? 
Have you ever like when you saw and you sense somebody's looking at you here? Say that saw it's a like a way you shave your quiet and you know sense some to you. I make and go shave. And I keep on Mr. Troika. I realized this guy was looking at me. Yare ha chika sheba the same guy abono rumu shave. I went on. He went on that other side. Then he came and say. Yaba ni nungu tla huye na ur. Kena kita sabot la huye na papa. But I was afraid to come to you. Kena noga must come to you. Then he said, I'm hungry. He's clean. He's very good looking. I'm talking about your hand doing something. Being generous. And this guy has got a, a, a small machel. It's a big king. king. 500 the same whatever. guy on the same guy and he's got bread inside the, the, the basket. And now, what's your favorite more? Sorry? I can't understand. Right. So, what's your favorite more? And now, I did try to do favorite more. Did I tell you that more? Hallelujah. So, Fagumoya in Hamonat, have you ever noticed that? And now, then when Uja Fagumoya, Fagumoya? How is I on two? Can need to Fagumoya. But what depend on this Fagumoya is from which shop? Impaning how can I say about a bona, but I shop on then I started to minister to this guy. Looking at how in a smart way. Then I asked him. I said, are, are you are you asking this to me just because you see how I look? You know, it's nice to tap in the spirit. Also, the standard of the world, what it says. Oh, but the monk. But when I'm a prophet, I think I should have said, "Well, I'm not too lazy in that." I should have said, "Well, I'm not too lazy in that." I should have said, "Well, I'm not too lazy in that." I should have said, "Well, I'm not too lazy in that." I should have said, "Well, I'm not too lazy in that." I should have said, "Well, I'm not too lazy in that." I should have said, "Well, I'm not too lazy in that." I should have said, "Well, I'm not what does that mean? It means what I'm trying to tell you. By my approach to say to this guy, you are asking me this because you see me dressing like this. It was more it is arrogancy. We understand. But I wanted to draw him and challenge him to the point where at the end he must understand. Then we And I tell you, it happened. And he said to me, No, I just, when I lift my eyes, I saw you first time and I realized that you have seen me, then I was afraid to come to you. Then, came, then, then, then I said to him, Okay, you are hungry. Then I started to ask him, But then why you have a basket and already this stuff, whereas you are hungry and you don't have money? I like this way of faith, you know. Then he said, I, I knew that I would love to eat this. I don't need anyone's money, but I would like to eat this. And that is why I'm carrying this. That's why I get my car shop. I don't want you to give money. I want you, if you have, pay for me this. Then I said, I'm going to take 30 minutes and this. I'll wait in that. As we were talking, two guys came. They stood and they said, it's like we know you. Do we know you in that? 
Then I said, ah, man, maybe I'm on TV all the time. I made a joke <laughs> of it. Mm. And they say, but we know you, man. You preach somewhere. Okay, thank you. Then they pass. Then he says, now I understand why I was looking at you all the time. Then I said, okay, is this real thing that you want? I put myself at risk. Eh? Even my pocket. I said to this guy, are you sure this is what you want? Are you sure this is what you want? No, take what you want. Imagine, uh-huh. small basket, basket if you can leave it there uh-huh. and take uh-huh. the big drawers. Go on, son, I'm going to minister. I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, Then he said, oh, this guy says, no, I need this. This is what I need. I don't need anything. Then I said, okay, let's upgrade what you are having. Instead of Fakumoya, get something blue ribbon or albano or whatever. Uh, instead of Boroto Bobo, Bekuanka Shopongamo. Samonka Boroto Bobo, Bitterinia, Nekaba Albanica for Super. Then he brought a proper bread. Yavanino Motale Boroto Bobo, Tenya. Carab Crater Machio Arm. Are I a good less than that? Some machine, then he brought two liters of machine. Two liters. I paid for him. I'm a battle, and when we pay, I get jumpy. I get a battle. I'm told next of it to come. Amen. How battle are on us? I look how he acted. Then he put the bread and 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 machine. Look, listen what he says. Then on puts a um kicking in the language. I'm kicking in the checkers. I'm a plastic. I'm kicking in the checkers. Yeah, yeah, the checkers. Then he stand there, you know, so that he, he doesn't want to show the war again. How can I tell you that I paid. 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 I I I I I I I I I I I I he said, God, my hand was on the deck. Oh, glory to Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. My hand was on the deck. It was not a lot of money. But the impact. The impact. Of being obedient in the spirit of the Lord. When you are obedient, how do you know that God can use your hand to bring healing and bring fulfillment to one another? So our hands need to be in the, on the deck. Signs and wonders take place when our hands are working. You know, this story that I just shared, story I just feel it's enough. I feel, I sense that's what God wants you to hear. I want to show you two things quickly. Last week we said that we have three, three four major things that are coming in the new year. Can you put that slide up then? We said that January we will be relaunching. And it's going to be big. And in June we have our birthday or our 20th anniversary. And on that anniversary, on that anniversary we will have three days of celebration. The Friday evening we will be saying we are still standing, Lord. 
la bohlano mantsi bo wa re tla be re re gentse re yeme then saturday we will be having a gala dinner here even in saturday re tla ba le ho a golelana dijo tsa motshea tsa mantsi tsa mantsi bo and then the sunday of that it will be our super sunday and then sunday saturday re tlo ba le super sunday then we have a gospel festival that we, we shining light are going to organize re tlo ba le gospel le tshebeletso ya ya e re tlo ba le yona ka shining light so if you are not on the list of the volunteers at that time how sitting ka bosi ka golo ya ba ithaupi na go nyeo there's a possibility ka golo wena you'll have to buy a ticket at 300 or 400 ona le menyetla o re lo wena o ka ithekela ticket yeno ya boleng bo so we trust god for that gospel festival re tshepa modimo re tshebeletso yeo that thousands of people will fill up the main auditorium hore batho ba no ba bangata ba no ba tlotlala main auditorium and uh, will be having around may as shining light leadership summit for two days that leadership summit ho kopanele ho ho tlisa ho ha ba eta pele it will be leaders all over ito ba ba eta pele bohle pastors leaders in different fields in the church ba ruti le ba eta pele batho bohle ba megwa e fapaneng kereke the work has to be done mo sebetsi wa bona o tlame ho etsa we need to put our hands on the deck re tswanela ho bea matso wa rona tshebetso for all those things to happen ho re dintho tse o ka o fela di etsahale they need all of us di hloka bohle ba go for a mechanic to fix the car ho re mechanic ya lokise koloi at the end of the day his hands has to be dead ketelong ya letsatsi matso a ya tlame a beditsi ka ba kala di oil and grease all those things hallelujah for a doctor to perform an operation ho re ngaka ka pomoki a etse operation no matter how much he can sanitize his hands ha o tsotelle o rena a ka hlakola matso a ka sebola di kokwana hlokwa ka and gloves ho re a ka bea di glove ha kae at the end of the day ketelo nya le tsatsi his hands come out with blood matso a ya tlotla ana le mati hloka o tlo moyeng o ntwe ke bua if you can hear the spirit then the lord will help you how can you kwa sena semoye modimo tlo thusa in order to reach a certain organ has to go through others hore o fihle lentong o tshwanela o tsene o fohle in order to have that hore ho belesela and we learn this from christ he came and he didn't come and fold his hands he tutile sena ho morena jesus hore o tlile mme ho tle ngwae ha ka ba putha matso he took a lot we la bua holo he touch a lot ya bane no go tshwara le ha ho now it's our turn no ke na go ya ro to get our hands dirty hore matso wa rona be di tshile we cannot afford to remain comfortable ha re tlo khona ho ge dule ge ge iphumuletse saving the lord as if we are busy ensuring that our life cover it's fine re shebeletse modimo jwalo ka ha ka e ka re 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 bolokeile ka pa re 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 bo mo bo the insurance people when they come to you they say to you before you die but ba insurance ya ngata ha ba tla ho wena ba re pele o shwa what have you prepared o hlopileng we are not going to operate like that ha re tlo tsa ma jwalo people don't have relationship with the lord jesus christ but to have another command or more than jesus and all that impasena tsena tsohle wants to help us to fulfill that di tlame a hore thusa o re fihle le tabatabelo ye but we need as we said at the beginning of this month re tlame a hore go latela se re se buile matlalong a gwedieng we said lord we raise our hand re itse modimo re phamitse matso a ro and we said lord strengthen our hands re itse modimo o tlolla matso a ro and today we say all hands on the deck ka jeno re re matso ohle tshebetso and next week we'll be saying this be ke tlang ga tlaberere a hand le tsoho a silent voice ke lentswe le sabui but it's got a voice impa ana le lentswe 
but they are silent. That's what I did to that guy yesterday. It was a silent hand. But that work. We will never afford to look away. We'll use our hands to help one another. I want you to, to, to look at this clip that they're going to play here. Can you play me that video clip, please? Together we can. And we, are, we can achieve more. If truly we say we raise our hands, we can achieve a lot. So some of you, you are not here last week. Baba Mbalona nerele siko begenye fitile. You missed how we did it. When you look at that, how there was no way this guy could cross without others. He tried first alone. Being afraid of being gossiped about. But he God courage and say, let me call others. Therefore, I am calling you. I am I not. I challenge you. I did it so well last week. Without um, being emotional about it. Making it spiritual so that they are out of Papa, but this decision I'm not sure I can or a house why I don't want you to be in that space. Ha battle who be clear senses. Oh battle or my kutu awards a pame mo. If the Lord was able to use me inside the supermarket, Hyba Modimonia Chemiserity almost seven is a supermarket. He can use you without a worship song. Or oh, me shouting Amen so deep. Last week we said to each other, I, as the spiritual leader in this church, I challenge you as pastors who are the pastors. I, I challenge the church council the counselors I challenge small group leaders. O challenge the small group leaders. And everyone in the church. That we say this month we raise our hands up. And we say, Lord, we know that you can strengthen us. And we want to put our hands at work. And I challenged. If you didn't see it on the YouTube, I challenged them. And I said that I want you to pledge for this huge job that is there. Nobody will do it. And when you do this, I don't want you to look at your when our heart. You are not, you are, you are, you are not, you are not, you, there's nothing that you are for to it. 
but it is through Christ that you are being able to achieve what you achieve. Empane ninke ka le baka fela la Christ to ro ka fihlella ka po fihlella tse o nang le tsona ka fotse o ka dietsa. For us to win the battle. Hore rona re bentweng. It's when our hands are at work. Ke ha matso wa rona a le mosebetsi. The first step that I challenge you for. Mohato a pele re tshwanelang ho etsa. Is the pledging yo kopanela ka po sebeletsa pledging o ko fana ko fana ka pa it's like a declaration actually mm. but when you do it with with something that is financial we say we pledge i cannot oh. the correct way o ha re fana hangata e sebediswa ha o fana ka nthotse ka amampa ko tlo ka po ile boemo ba di chelete ga ka pledge you don't have idea you guys who were here last week you don't know how happy I am standing here. What, what, you you did. Did. what you did last week is amazing. The pledges for last week. I know that it's, you took envelope. And that you took envelope. And that envelope, envelope. It is nothing up until it's got something in it. I get so guess what you did last, last week? All the envelopes that you took the envelope amounts to 10,400. Yo. You, not me, it's you. Yeah, you can clap hands. Hallelujah. <laughs> In a space of five, less than five minutes, ngiyanyani Mm. Then we, I put three amounts inside the envelope. the envelope, the envelope, the we have 500. We have 1,000 envelopes. Last week, your hands made me to be able to say by the 15th of January 2023. Already we have 10,400. Already 10.4. So I get to be more away and I do it. Now I'm not talking only with you who were not here last week. How we little nobody by the sick of a key. I even talked to you who took last week. Oh, boy, a little luna happy by anybody. I said, not not about me, you know, but a fellow and not every I get to stop our water. Mola, if you are here, I won't stop you. Get all of it because you just need to operate under obedience. See how somebody must be a more. If you are here Hi, and say, I want to be part of that, you can come and take your envelope. I read the secret. Mm, it is not a secret. You can come and take your envelope. You say, I pledge for this. I raise my hand. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Please. Lord, I pledge this because you understand now. Don't take that envelope for Mudima out. He said, blessing or whatever. I said, the blessing. Get the seed that you plant for the work to be done. Hallelujah. Because I'm just a mere person. But you do this out of obedience. 
When I on a chalet, when I came with demon in chalet. On a next win. If we in kilo and one another, also did to fight some more long way. Marwena, no, a thousand new cassia foot. You could kiss and flop here a thousand new. Of it winking right. Maybe we kill a trend retain a more long arm, a thousand naked off a yon. You could kiss a tap along with you, Miss Someone. Just do what it is right. I really thank God. Maybe demo when some mistake you kill say three. Praise the Lord. The mudimo ubalwe now while nonka two hundred. Maga mudimo it's a raw swagat envelope and swagat say three. So it's something that God is saying to you. The envelope. 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 But if and at any time you want to bring it, you can bring it. Can I come in hello every day? Just bring it. You will know what I think. So, the fellow like the 15th of January, 2023. Yeah, we are It's a This is not a game. I give up all the I can manipulate I give up a tunnel in Chalet. Give up a lot of bomb my own demo room by its aim. Because I get a cabarona. I hate to eat a Marietz like him. I am with him. It to eat a half. Lord, I thank you, Mudimo Kaluki Lang. I am so careful, Lord, that I must not manipulate your people. But Lord, I feel so strong in my heart, in my spirit. This is what we have been staring all along. As we will be relaunching next year, as we will be having the anniversary, as we will be having, Lord, the summit, as we will be having the gospel festival, Lord. I pray in the name of Jesus. Favor your how mudimu aka ike dule. Oba mudimu will be knocking in their doors. That will help us, Lord, to realize what you said for us. That there is a sinner, that's a force daily manka pamang. Mara rebata we a sinner mudimu aka. Ruta mo ya wa o halalela. Aba to bask about one lady Mudimuaka. About away, no Mudimuaka Luki Lang. On a sale, Gabaiza Sansona says secretly, say bitter. Late or nothing, my God. And me and them standing here, Lord, we are so poor without you. But with you, Lord Jesus, we are so rich. Father, I pray right now, Kalibizola Jesu Nazareta, instill. In their minds, Lord, the creative ways. If somebody has to buy a pack of chepi simutimwaka and sell it 50 cent to make it 300, to make it 1,000, let it be. For you don't despise the small beginning, Mudimwaka. Father, I pray in the name of Jesus that this step that we took, the enemy that may not steal it from us, may you seal Mudimwaka all the hearts. That were touched in doing this. Seal them with the blood of Jesus. That in our giving, totally and therefore, Lord, we say our hands are on the deck in this. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen.